Hey there, welcome back to Tolstoy Gaming Channel's Let's Play of Resident Evil 4. And let's go ahead in and hunt some bugs. <laughs> Going's gonna be a little tough for us because the shotgun is completely underpowered. So I'm gonna be using four bullets uh, per shot. Let's do this. Might even get a little ways in and <laughs> go back to tune up a shotgun one here. Stop sneezing at my shotgun, it's rude. God damn it, like I need that. rifle ammo I use doing this, and a red eye, and some TMP ammo. Alright, so far so good. Now, right over here. Didn't quite get him in the air, but... Shots, that's not good. Green eye. Hello. Oh crap! That's my own damn fault. Incendiary. Shotgun shells, which I'm going to load into the gun. There you are! Fuck. God damn it. There we go, knock your ass down. Are you running from me, little boy? Better run. What the hell is it? Okay, this is legitimately creepy. Where the hell did it go? There you are! Alright, I think, and you guys don't need to be here with me when I do it, I've had enough of this bullshit. I'm going to go and trade in some stuff with the merchant, bring and uh, afford the 24,000 upgrade to the shotgun's power. I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. And while you were gone, I went to see the merchant, and I upgraded my shotgun one on the firepower. That should help me to combat the bugs. I was having way too much trouble there. Now I should be able to be at least competitive. Okay, this memo is all about parasites. Not really relative or all that important to the game. So I'm just going to go to each screen 
and stay on it long enough for you to hit the pause button if you actually want to read this stuff. This has really no relevance to the game. God only knows why they put it in there. Just to talk about parasites, I guess. But, whatever. Luis is talking about uh, how parasites can affect the host, and that's what the Las Plagas are doing, so... Yeah, I guess it's somewhat relevant. Okay, complete heal, yay. Let's get back to... Oh yeah, can't open this yet. This door's too rusted and it won't budge. So let's get down to the rest of this place. Oh, and just for the sake of my own self, I want to see something. Red and a green so far. Got it. We're looking for reds, greens, and blues. So far we haven't gotten a blue yet. It's likely we won't get any this time. But, hopefully I'm wrong. Looks like a drainage valve. Drain the water? Yeah, sure, why not? Okay. Now in here, we get what that, those eyes go into. The butterfly lamp. Two out of three. A lamp with two eyes. That space right there uh, requires a blue eye, which are ridiculously rare and hard to get. I might just use the crap out of that, come to think of it. Alright. That puts me at almost full power. Now we're gonna come back out here. Oh, and before you leave. Aim up. Yeah, that tune-up definitely helped. Yep, I definitely needed that tune-up. Damn it, green. Alright, now I can enjoy this. Damn me for a fool for not getting that uh, tune-up in the first place. Okay, as soon as I turn this corner, he's gonna come busting out of there. Come here. No, you don't. Crap. Oops! Didn't know you were gonna spawn right in front of me. Please be a blue. Oh, fuck. Alright, still got some more chances. Where is it? There it is! <laughs> fuck you, I hit you. Ah, wasted shot. And of course, it's my next to last shot. Or it was, anyway. Alright, let's keep going. This is the water that I just drained. Come out here. Turn around, and we got bug. Damn it. Fuck. Missed it by one shot. Alright. Fuck. Where are you? And of course he gives me ammo instead of a goddamn eye. Well, what do you got? Shotgun shells. Alright, I guess that'll work because we're not done with these guys yet. Really? Oh, seriously, we're not. Because there's one more bug left to spawn. Let's go kill it. Although we gotta go all the way back to the beginning of the stage. To get him. Which 
I don't know about you guys, it's fine with me. I don't know about you guys, but I got nothing but time. Fuck. Again, missed it by one. God damn it! I'm betting it's shotgun shells. Brother. Alright, I'm tired of a bug hunt. Let's keep going. Well, damn me for a fool anyway, you know? I think I tuned up the handgun too much and I should have paid more attention to the shotgun. That's my own fault. But, whatever. What's done is done. And I got the rest of this down, baby. Alright, so, moving onward. Got us a green herb. Alright, in all seriousness, who builds this shit in their house? Because that's basically what this castle is. It's his house. Whatever. Sheesh. Noisy enough for you? Let's go ahead and equip that damn grenade. Head out. And around. We got us a couple barrels to break. With some crap in them. Now, let's use the crap out of this grenade that I saved. Hopefully I get all of them in one hit. But right away I'm gonna equip a handgun. Make sure that I miss this jump so that I wind up on the ground. Where do you think you're going? Ha! You're not going anywhere, Bubba. You're staying right here and you're giving me that goddamn treasure. Well, boy, you talk about sloppy. Los Illuminados pendant. Eight spinels are scattered around the room. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I missed it over here. Eight. All right, now that we've got that business cleaned up, let's take care of the puzzle in this room. Here's Mr. Man, but he's locked in. So let's unlock him. Stairs. Now this time we actually want to get across on the chandelier. Okay. Turn around and pop these. Got this velvet blue and some money. I'm gonna open your cage. Over to the other chandelier. Make sure we get a crawl. Oh, damn it! Ugh. Oh, 
Today seems to be my day for sloppy gameplay. Yikes. Let's try this again. Alright, like I said. Jump so we get across. Thank you. And we come over here. And here's a treasure that we were looking at earlier. We get... The second elegant mask. Alright. So. Let's stick the purple gem in there. And open up the cages. Yay. Alright. Now let's get back to Mr. Man and see if I've got any business for him. Welcome! Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Yeah, I know you do. What are you selling? Let's see what I can get rid of, first of all. I think I've got some shit to sell to you. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. That was a lot of cash quick, wasn't it? Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna need one green eye for another lamp. I'll sell one. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Keep Thank the other. You. And this Los Illuminados pendant can be sold. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see what he's got. What are you buying? Ah, uh, handgun, red nine, TMP, okay. So the only things I can tune up are the handgun and the TMP. What you got for the TMP, Bubba? 24 and 15, that's 39. I think I'll get the firepower at least. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Last time I left a firepower what are behind, you buying? it bit me in the butt. Oh god, everything's all goddamn expensive. Oh, let's see. I can do reload speed and capacity, and I kind of need capacity at the... No, I don't. I can see that I've got some spare bullets over there. <sighs> Let's bring up the firepower, I guess. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. And we'll hold the other 52 for next time. Come back any time. And head on to our next area, where I hopefully won't do so goddamn sloppy. Boy. DSP level gameplay right there, I tell you what. Ah, crap. Okay, this should be fun. Let's see if I've got it. This should be amusing. Ah, uh, yeah. We'll go on the TMP. The Castellan. For many years, the Salazar family has served as castellans of this castle. However, not everything is bright, for my ancestry has a dark past. Long ago, there once was a religious group that had deep roots in this region called the Los Illuminados. Unjustly, however, the first castellan of the castle took away their rights and powers. As a follower of this religion and the eighth castellan, I felt it was my duty as well as my responsibility to, re to atone for that sin. I knew the best way to atone for the sin was to give power back to those who we once took it away from, the Los Illuminados. As expected, it took a little time, but we were able to rejuvenate the once sealed Las Plagas. With this success, I was one step closer to the revival of the Los Illuminados. It's all this asshole's fault. The reason why I released the Las Plagas from deep under this castle and gave them to Lord Sadler was not only to repay for the sins of my ancestors, but I felt certain that the Lord would make better use of the power to help save the world. <laughs> you thought wrong. To save those that have sinned with the power of the Las Plagas and to cleanse their souls, creating a create and to create to save those that have sinned with the power of La the Las Plagas and to cleanse their souls, creating a world without sinners. The way it was meant to be. Once cleansed, they would become one of the many ganados where they would find their reason to live. 
After the Lord has succeeded in creating the world in which he has envisioned, then the sins of my Salazar family will be atoned for. Oh, brother, it's all this idiot's fault. Alright, this idiot here. Well, first of all, let's, uh... Ow. Let's take rid of these gu get rid of these goddamn archers. So much as oh. I actually got my beam on him for once. I've never been able to get my beam on him. All right. There you go. Let's go ahead and nothing. Break all these bases before we go up to the next level. This is how I redeem myself from my last idiot bit of gameplay. Thought I saw somebody up there. Hi, Amy. Thank you. Is there anybody behind me? No. <laughs> Keep getting the feeling somebody's behind me. Anyway. What I want to do is take out everybody on that platform so that I'm able to snipe at the boss. Succeeded in that. Let's get the rifle bullets over here. I actually half want to fail this because the final confrontation is kind of fun. All right, let's do it. Come on, die! Got him! Just as he was about to make the door, too. Whew! If the rifle had been any slower, he would have gotten away. Oh, that's a full mag? Okay. And that's a full mag. This is not. I feel redeemed. I think by getting him, even though it was a really close call, I feel very redeemed. Alright, now that all my guns are loaded... See, this is what we're after, the key to this. It's locked. So, let's go get it from him now that we killed him. And you notice it gets awful quiet once you do that. figured as much. Never know how to file those bullets right. And you get four containers of money here to help you in your quest to upgrade your guns. Come around here. And here's our boy, nice and dead. And we get the gallery key. Yeah, if he had gotten one step farther, he'd have gotten out this door and I would have had one more shot at him. But, still, not a very good shot. But, anyway, we're done here. Let's go ahead and go back the way we just came. <laughs> and get through this area and over to the next. Yeah, stop breathing so hard, Leon. Jeez. It's not that much of a thing for you. You're a big boy. 
All right. It's locked. Let's use that gallery key. God damn, I went all that way around and he died right next to the door that I need that I needed to open. Boy, am I ever observant, aren't I? Let's go in. Oh, that's right, this. And get that velvet blue. And nothing from that one. And money and ammo. And let's go to the latest troll puzzle. Now I say troll puzzle because Capcom really trolled us gamers when they did their puzzles. Check out the solution to this one. The sacrifice of six lives shall make way the true path. Look at what winds up solving this. One, two, three, four, done. God. The things we learn after the fact, right? One, two, three, four, that's like the combination to an idiot's luggage. Hey, that's the combination of my luggage. in surprise. But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise, but I'm only 20 years old. So you're just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get rid of our American friend. This one's a little tricky, but not horrible. Let's get some crowd control going on, shall we? I saw you! ends that. Alright, now let's gather some stuff. Oh, you're gonna make it easy for me, are you? Yeah, I know what that laugh means. Somebody's behind me. Get Leon healed up. Turn around. Ow! I really hate our troops, I gotta say. Especially ones that camp underneath an area where I can't get them. That is a green right here. There we go. Let the stage do half my work for me. No more lanterns left, sadly. And these idiots moved before they could use it. I could chase them around the world, but why? I 
have to just kill it. With the newly increased power of my TMP? No, I didn't have any. Go ahead and load my guns up. No, I didn't have any flash grenades. Alright. So, now that we've got that done, and I gathered the uh, green herb and the spinel that was in the area, just have to collect these handgun grenades, handgun, handgun grenades, handgun bullets, and activate the uh, security system. It looks like a security system of some sort. Deactivate. Alright. Now we have to deal with these two yams, which isn't too hard. First of all, we need to get across the room and into here. Now they're going to tell. All right, when I go back out that door. Let's press this button. There's a switch. Press it. Sure. Now they're gonna, with their RPGs, they're gonna run across the ramp and get onto that area so that when I open this door, I'm going to be opening the door to a couple of guys with RPGs in their hand. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to let the door close back, protect me, and then I'll kill them. Let's do it. Back up, Leon. And let's kill these motherfuckers. Sometimes extra dudes will spawn, sometimes they don't. This time, obviously, they didn't. Oh, and before we do that, we have a place we need to go. There is a yellow herb here. Which makes for a full heal, yay. And as we go down here... There's just... This is just a way to get to the top floor. But that yellow's gonna come in handy. Alright. Just for the sake of doing it, since I didn't get to do it during the fight. Okay. Now we come across here and we get... Ooh, we actually got shit! TMP ammo, yay! And in here... We've got the GOAT Tournament! Part one of three to get that big old wall open. Now the doors we need to go through open. And we can get out of here finally. Yay! Ah! Oh, good! Excellent! typewriter right at the right spot. I think I'm going to go ahead and save the crap out of the game. And when we come back, we'll uh, deal with some more nonsense. And some crows, too. So, check it out on the next chapter, and I'll check you out on the next chapter, and I bid you adieu.